Hey, my name is Ty. I own White Score Woodworking, and I wanted to make a video showing you guys how to assemble the bench and how easy it is. All you need for this is a Phillips head screwdriver. If you do not have one, message me and I will send you one. So to start off, we're going to put on the two back legs. So as you can see, I have everything labeled. So the one, two, three, and four, and there is holes corresponding to that. And you will see on your leg, there will be a number and an arrow. The arrow will pour the arrows should point inwards towards each other on each leg and then the corresponding number on the leg will go into the corresponding hole so i'm going to grab leg three and you can see there are two dowels you're going to slide leg three into its corresponding holes take one of the long screws insert it into the pre-drilled hole and then take your screwdriver and you can just easily tighten it down. Now this screw doesn't have to be super tight because all this is doing is holding the base from sliding outwards on the top. Structurally the dowels and the shelf between the legs will hold all of the force. Next up, I'm going to take leg four and do the exact same process. As you can see, the legs are a little wobbly, but that is totally normal and nothing to worry about. Once the shelf is in, they'll be nice and sturdy. Once we have both our legs installed, we're going to go ahead and grab our shelf. Now this piece is also numbered depending on which slot it goes into in the leg. So I'm going to take the four mark, line it up with the four leg, the three mark, line it up with the three leg. And the shelf is very easy to install. You simply just slide it into the dados that we have cut. Slide it back. And then you can insert the screws with the pre-drilled holes onto the back side. Once we have that part complete, we can see that the base is a lot sturdier. So we're going to go ahead and put on the two back legs doing the exact same process. Once everything's assembled, we're going to carefully flip the bench over. Boom! And just like that, we have a nice little bench. And this shelf, because of the way it sits on these dados, is super strong and can hold a lot of weight. As well as the bench is nice and sturdy. <laughs> We do level all of our benches before we ship them out using our flat table. So if you notice your bench has a little rock, then you can use those little foam pads and stick them to the bottom of the feet to level it out. Depending on where you put it in your house, your floors aren't always flat and it may have a little rock, but you can simply just shave or add on little foam pads to the base. I've also provided you guys with these little plugs. So if you don't like the look of these little screw holes, simply take these little plugs pop them over the hole. I like to align the grain, that way they uh, don't look as obvious. And just take the back of your screwdriver and just push them in. 